Okay, I think we're about ready. Oh. Let me swap it over. So, it's been the weekend. I need to remember what I was doing. However, I noticed the stream crashed during the during that wait. I'm just going to keep an eye on it. If it crashes again, we might call it, but we'll see. See how it goes. Uh, anyway, let's get back to it. All right. So last time we beat base and we made it to Black Earth. Uh, okay, so the plan was to try to get the green mystery data that's in random battles. That was the first plan. Wait, what's... Many, many navvies. This door opens only to those without... F only opens to those without V. No fra... Who no fragments, huh? That's the Black Earth 2. So we need to fight every navvy. Which we haven't even fought in Cold Man yet. So... Oh, I can't get away. Okay. Let me get back in the groove. Okay, just a couple more. So, we're trying to find a green mystery data in battle. Now I'm really thinking about it, I think I went through all the blue mystery data. So, I think we could skip that. At least all the blue mystery data that I can do. Uh, and then after, and then we go fight duo, I think. I think we could go fight duo. The other option, instead of fighting duo, is to is to like money grind so I could get so I could buy the HP but I can also do that in play through four I don't have to do that now more healing no I was going to say, I really need some healing. <laughs> I haven't saved yet, so that's fine. So yeah, last time we had to beat base. We had to get the five evil chips. We had, we had to get all standard chips just to fight base. Oh. I forgot there were, like, evil navvy or normal navvies here. I forgot about that. Wait, it didn't... It didn't work on him? Oh, is... He has to get hit by a sword? Then I can't hit him. I can't hit him if that's the case. Well, we could try Gun Soul. Perks power? I don't know. Yeah, the power of the sun doesn't work on the shadow, I guess. I don't have a sword to use. Well, that doesn't work. I think I have to run. This is where Proto -so Soul would be very nice. Yeah, I can't do anything. I can't do anything. Hmm. 
Sorry, just keeping. I'm just trying to keep an eye on the stream. Again, if it crashes like next, like not too distant future, then uh, I might just call it then and there. You know. Still looking for this green mystery data, random battle. Oh right, I wanted to double check my Navicuff stuff. Yeah, I wanted to do double check my Navicust and see what I can, what I have, and what I need to get. I should pull that up. It's too bad this is not Lightning Elemental anymore. <laughs> Oh no, blinder! There we go. Uh, what did I have? Navi customizer locations. Was it this one? It was this one, okay. Yeah, just trying to work on cleanup before moving to playthrough four, the final playthrough, so we could get this done. Oh, come on, like, nothing's, nothing's popping up. Uh, what to do? Mm. Okay, hold on. Get rid of this guy first. Do this. That's a strategy. And one that I almost died to. Honestly, I don't care if I get a game over. Which my I, I could go buy a, an HP memory or something. Can I run? Good. Supposedly, there's a battle with the green mystery data somewhere in in this. Do I have a lock enemy? No, I used it all. I used it all. It's fine. Like, it's not... It's, it would just n nicely go in my folder if I could find this fight. Let me see if I can... pull that guide up. Hold on. This one? Internet feels slow. Hold on. No, this, this is not it. What if I just this? Mystery data, boundary mystery data. Oh, even then, it's a 1 in 8 chance. Let me look at... Let me look at this. Ah, oh, here we go. Black Earth 1. Well, one of them requires battery, and normally it's like at 8%. Okay, and there's, there are two battles with green mystery data. 
One of them has a better chance of battery, and it's a 50%, but guess what? I don't have battery because I have not fought Cold Man. And the other one is just normal. There's just so many different enemy encounters that it's all like an 8 point something percent. Yeah, it's a battle with these guys, but there's two of them. Just two of these guys in a green mystery data. You know what? I think I'm gonna take a second to heal up. Try to end this. Oh, I better take that opportunity. Uh, of course. Oh, it was only 100 damage. I have nothing that can hurt him. I don't have any sword-based moves in my folder. Which I better put something in there. I could go Proto Soul. Just put a random sword chip in. I could do that. Oh, look. At least Varsword here would pair well with some of my stuff. Anything. Let's see. Sword based. Sword based. Anti sword? That wouldn't be enough to kill, but it would work. I mean, that works too. Okay. Since the strap might just be going to Proto Soul, we're just throwing one sword chip in. And let's just keep going. Makes me think I should come back and you know, do this, uh, get a lock enemy, leave, come back, maybe. There, getting rid of one enemy helped. It's not required to... It, it would just pair so well. But I also know... I also know I have a better shot of finding it if I wait. Because that was part of the reason why I wanted to go in here. Was this one green mystery data, but I forgot it was an in-battle green mystery data. Either way you look at it, though, I have to. I'm gonna want it at some point anyway. Whether it's I get it now or I get it later, I will want it in my folder. But leaving to buy a lock enemy wouldn't be the worst idea. It, again, it, it's this. There's one with these guys, but it's t oh, there's only two of them. Honestly, though, a lock enemy would work. I could just get in that fight, and then I, I could find the one with just two of them. I might do that. I might just do that. But there's that, oh, there's that part of me that's like, no, I'm going to find it. Like, right now. Okay, clearly not right now. I think the game has it to where if you run into those shadow guys, the game just automatically lets you run away from them. 
because if you don't have a sword chip to hurt them, then you're in the trapped game. Try another three random encounters. If I don't find it, I'll leave and buy an unlocker. Or, not unlocker, a lock enemy. And I might as well go buy HP memories if I can. One, this is two. I heard that. Yeah, I know. We finally get a pretty interesting palette swap. How's it going, Monzai? Uh, I am currently trying to see if I can find a battle with the green mystery data so I could get a uh, fast gauge star. But so far, nothing. All right. Here's what I'm going to try to do. Gonna leave. I am going to buy a lock enemy. I'm a, I have three on traps, I'll be fine. Let's see, who sells lock enemies? There we go. I'm gonna stream the head to my report. Very nice. Hope, uh, hope you have a good time in Japan. Oh, one thing. You know, thank you, sir, for the Again, like, have, have a good time down there. Uh, one thing I'm gonna double check right now. Uh, let's see. Let's take a look at my Navicus stuff. What am I missing? Let's see, Super Armor, Custom 1, Custom 2's in there. Mega Folder 1. So... Stellar HP program dealer. There's two more, but I would have to buy them. That's fine. Custom one. There's two more that I would that I can buy. It's all good. Okay. Okay. I guess. Okay. I don't have. I don't have this one. Green, blue mystery data. Black Earth two. Okay. I can't get that one. First barrier. Buy it. Shield. Buy it. I have Reflect. Anti-Magic, Buck Frag Trader. Float Shoe. Float Shoe. Yep. Air Shoes. Don't have that. Bug Frag Trader. Okay. Undershirt. Yep. Sneak Run. Yep. Oil Body. Fish. Batteries in the Antenna. Jungle. Collect. Okay, this one. Oh. This one's very uh, limited, isn't it? Humor. Uh, in the overworld, plus L, make Mega Man make jokes. But, Town Area 3, Navi during the third tournament. So it has to be done during the Blue Moon tournament. I didn't know this. Okay, Buster Pack, Body Pack. Uh, this one's Black Earth 2. Uh, bug stop, soul cleanse, black earth two, both are black earth two. Okay. Uh, rush, beat, tango. Okay, hold on. Two white ones, which they're both there. One pink, one yellow. Speed. Yeah, the, start with one. Yeah, this is right. And then charge. I think all are in here. One pink. No, two pinks. Two pinks. One white, one yellow. Okay. Attack max, bug frag dealer. Speed max, charge max. HP plus 50. How many are these? 
One of each color. One, two, three. Okay. Plus 100. Oh, uh, program dealer. You have to buy it. Okay, that's fine. HP plus 200. There's only three. Okay. Plus 300. There's only three. I have two. I'm missing pink. Program dealer in undernet. Okay, that's fine. Plus 400. I'm missing one. It's pink. Bug fracture. Park park area. Okay. And HP plus... Uh, there's two of them. We'll allow numbers. Okay. So, everything else I'm missing... Uh, well, a couple of them are going to be gotten in the next playthrough. No matter what, I'm not really locked out other than battery. Uh, humor, on the other hand, is the one I need to keep an eye on. Town Area 3, Navi, during third tournament. Yeah. Would fit. Yeah, uh, apparently humor is very time sensitive on you. I'm, I'm reading that apparently it's during the third tournament. Town Area 3. We could double check now, though. You know, you know what? Let's make a let's make a run to town area three. It says during the third tournament, but maybe like that's just the earliest you can do it, and he'll stay there. I hope that's the case. Let's take a look. Park area? Okay, yeah, we have... I had a feeling is it was down there. Because that's the only one I'm worried about. Is it that guy? That guy's the board dealer. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay. I never went down there uh, after him. So, yeah, okay. Then I guess it's not a time-sensitive thing. It's just like, hey, talk to him after this point. Yeah. I think humor is the only one that's really, like, the one I'm worried about. Rolls encounters down there? Well, we'll worry about that later. <laughs> I'm gonna take care of Navi stuff, like, fourth playthrough. Yeah, I'm saving all the Navi fights, I guess, other than Laser Man, for fourth playthrough. What are you looking at? Take a picture. It lasts longer. <laughs> huh. Huh, this Navi looks scary, but he's a fun guy. What's that, you say? What's so funny about me? Fun, funnity, fun, funnity, funny. Stop laughing at me. I'm not saying these things, because I want to. His jokes aren't really funny, but when he says them with that face, it looks like something's going on here. Will you listen to me? So what happened? The reason I, be I became this way is because some group called Nebula reprogrammed me, deprogrammed me, unprogrammed. Stop laughing! I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. Regardless of what I look like now, I'm a bad guy. One day, those Nebula guys forced a program into me. Ever since then, I've been saying strange things. Please, can you get this program out of, uh, out of me off? Wait, can you get this program out of, out of me off of me of me? What do you want me to do? What do you want to do, Lane? I'm not sure. He says that he's a bad guy. If we fix him, who knows what he'll do? Maybe we should just leave him like he is. No, please, you gotta help me, me, me. I promise I won't hurt you, you, you. I don't know if I can trust you. It's the truth. I never lie. If you're if you're lying, we'll put you back how you are now. Okay, okay. Just hurry. Just hurry up, bada bub bub bada bub bub. Uh, it's a weird dialogue. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Mega Man, let's go. We removed humor. All right. I'm back to normal. Thanks, kid. I owe you one. You can keep that program as a token, my thanks. 
Thanks again. <laughs> okay. We want to make the world of also nebula. Make heal Navi say funny joke. Okay, that was the only one I was worried about. Okay, seriously, it should just be like a single, uh, you know, a single square because it's not really hurting anything. But just for the sake of it. All right. Hey, Lamp, I brought a guest along today. A guest? I'd like you to meet him. It will only take a second. Are you ready? Here he is. Tayo! No way! Master Toneko! Otenko! Yeah, I'm going there for a minute. In five volumes, where is it? Still, right. Uh, okay, hold on. So, we need to go to. So, now that that's taken care of, other than battery, all of the. The uh, Navi Cuffs are basically the ones I need to buy. So that's fine. We're going to do another money grinding. As well as... Going to buy... Let's see if I can buy some HP memories while I can. Hey, Megman! I heard Chad picks his nose. Really? Lan, it's the phone. Hello? Lan, were you just talking about me? No, no, no. Why would I be doing that? Hmm. He's got big ears, too. Not again. <laughs> I was going to have a counting Sparkman, Thunderman when you have two. Yeah, exactly. We're going to want it eventually. I used Untrap, didn't I? Yeah. Okay, okay. Why couldn't Draki's wife get to sleep? Oh, I don't think I even want to know. Because of his coffin! Nyark, nyark, nyark. Are you enjoying yourself, Mega Man? Jeez, it seems like Lan's also in on the joke, too. You know? Because he's the one that made the... Uh, he was talking about uh, Chad. <laughs> Though it seems like they appear a lot anyway. Especially when you don't want them... Exactly, that's always the case. You all you can never find the Navi when you want to find them. But they'll always show up when you don't want them to. That's how it works. That's how it always works. More Zenny. I hear Django once chased Draki all the way to Sharo. Oh yeah? What happened? He came back with Frostbite. That's not funny. It isn't funny. 24.5, it's really it's a lot fun. Wait, Junkman is in 4.5? Oh yeah, duh. Junkman. I, I don't know why. I got got it confused with like Dustman. Yeah, Junkman. I'm getting my navvies confused. Actually, you know, when you said junk man, I was thinking the robot master. So I was thinking that design. I was I totally forgot like how he looked like in here for a second. Totally blanked. You know, I'm growing kind of tired of my hairstyle. I think it's time for a change. What kind of hair do you want? Actually, there's a style I'm kinda of fond of. Let's see. Voila! So he changed his picture to look like this guy? That's the hair he wants? Ugh, that's horrible! I'm just kidding. Gee whiz. Okay. Might as well try to get some bug fragments out of this. I was gonna say, is that blender? No, it's like, it's probably anti-water. The hardest fights in the game are the 
1,200 normal navvies. Are you talking about 4.5 specifically? Okay, yeah, we bought all of the HP memories from him. Is there another green? I want to find the other green. I'm gonna money grind to buy stuff. And 4.5, yeah. <laughs> specifically. Makes sense when you don't directly control the Navi. And they have just so much HP. There we go. More Zenny. Hey, Lane, do you have any good jokes? Is that the. Is that the wrong picture? Good jokes? Um, I can't think of anything right now. Hey, who are you? Oops. Sorry, I forgot to put on my helmet. What? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay, it was the wrong picture, but, you know. With humor, y you question it, you know? Well, actually, with Battle Network 4, you question it. There's some of the viruses that blind you. I am happy as blinded. They move randomly, subcharging their charge shots and fire the buster in pack. Oh, yeah. Wait, normal Navi summon viruses too? Oh yeah, they probably summon the trumpets and stuff like that. And the fans. Hey, Lan. Where do people in Sharo keep their money? I don't know. Where? In snowbanks. Ugh. Right. Well, uh, heal navvies will summon attacking viruses. Normal navvies will summon support viruses. Okay. Right. Green mystery data. Recover. Don't need that. Another green. There it is. More zenny. Hey, Lan, I think I'm finally getting a hang of this humor. Oh, yeah? Give me your best shot. Knock, knock. Who's there? Joe Mon. Joe Mon who? But Joe Mon Frank... What? Stop! I'm not hearing this! My fans also make things awful because... The navvies have to be exact distance for them to use chips to send... Oh, right, yeah. I bet that would be annoying. It's part of the reason why... You, I think you can kind of see the problem when you look at the AI fighting Airman in like the Navi turn in the free tournaments, because Airman almost always wins those fights, and I think it's because of the constant wind that he's using. So I think the AI just doesn't really have a good way to deal with it. Nightman, it's awful. Nightman's in 4.5? Huh. Hey, Lan. Oh, snowbanks. Okay. Same joke already. Wow. Can we buy HP? Yeah. A few interesting navvies are in 4.5. I. Lan, I just want to say thanks for everything. What's gone into you? I'm tired of fighting day in and day out. It's over between us, Lan. W what? Don't worry. I've arranged for another Navi to take my place. Farewell, Lan. Wait! Mega Man! There's nothing to worry about. You will be fine in my hands. Uh, who's there? <laughs> Shade Man. Ah! Did I scare you? Not funny, Mega Man. Definitely not funny. Shadow Man, I... Iceman, Napalm Man, Plant Man, and Left Man. Huh. And I know, like, some characters from uh, Network Transmission are in there, like Star Man. Kind of interesting lineup. More Zenny. Oh, this is a great one. This is a great fight to get bug fragments, honestly. Oh. 
one. I was about to use Pile Driver, but no, that was the wrong, wrong one. Right. 900 HP. So, I need five more HP memories. One's in Black Earth 2. One is in one of the antennas. I buy at least one from Undernet 1, which I don't have the money for. I think one or two is in Undernet 5. Oh, I didn't need to do that. I meant to run. But wait, 4.5 is in the new art style, right? Of Battle Network 4. So, did they have to redesign, like, some of these other navvies, like Plant Man? And by redesign, I just mean just the slight art style, uh, art style change. Hmm. Makes you wonder why they didn't show up in other Battle Network games like Plant Man. That's, uh, so, Undernet 5 is the only other Undernet net dealer, right? So, I think there's just the two HP memories from that guy. I think we know where they all are, so I think we're safe on that front. Ah, oh, dang it, come on! I have to fight the spider now? When he has the support from the trumpet. Let's have a little bit of fun here. Protosoul. Have you gone in here? I don't know how much damage it did, but it worked out. to increase your custom gauge is to use your buster and charge shot, which is why being silent sucks. Uh, are you talking... Still talking about 4.5? This guy is going to... So I think the charge shot... Uh, the white shot... Uh, the white sword did 80 damage, like a normal white sword. Yeah. Again, I, I feel like I need to try out 4.5. Just to know what you're talking about. Or Zenny. Come on, can I run? I don't want to fight the spider. Yay. All navvies can use a buster as an option, except for Mega Man. That makes no sense to me. Who has the Mega Buster? Oh, okay. Okay, there's, I guess there's a difference between the Buster and the Mega Buster. Okay. Ooh. Green Mystery Data, you say? Fun with Pro Soul. Eh, okay. And the Mega Buster increases your custom gauge more than the regular Buster. That's the one advantage. So Mega Man's main thing is using a lot of chips. Okay, so. Hmm. That's just weird. Does Mega Man have any other perks? Like, being able to use the souls, like, Proto Soul and stuff like that? 
Or is it literally just only using Mega Man? No, I want to get to Undernet 6. So I do want to go this way. Got a little confused on directions. So every other Navi basically has to rely on their own Mega Bu Not Mega Buster, just their own Buster. Just to get through most fights. You know, I should take the opportunity to heal. Now I could take the opportunity to find a boomerang and heal up. Number soul is. Notice how the reflect the shield with reflect looks like Proto Man shield. I think they just copied and paste. No souls, no synchro either. Hmm. So the benefit of playing as Mega Man is that he can use a lot of chips, but he's just kind of the all around character. So what's the benefit of playing the, as the other characters? Just for fun? Oh yeah, I know you can play as base as well. I know that's another character you can play as. Or play as is a, is a strong way to describe it. Each one can do different things. Okay. But it sounds like Mega Man's main thing is using a lot of chips. Like, that's the main gimmick with basic Mega Man. So, yeah, give me an example of what some of them can do like what their uh, main gimmick is barriers throughout the net that can only be earned by certain kinds of navvies so like tornadoes can only be removed by windman or base and roll is a woman okay i guess that makes her more unique i mean to be fair there's only like two or three female characters or female navvies in battle network so that is kind of unique She gets t discounts on Wednesday. Oh, there's actually a reason for it. Okay. Again, to be fair, there's only like three female female navvies in Battle Network. And some of them, you could argue, are not canon. Battle Chip Challenge has ring. But... Is ring cannon? I don't know. And special... Is that the only way you could get those chips? I mean, discounts are one thing, but is that the only way you could get those chips? Roll just uses her feminine charms to get a discount. Or that's just a policy of the, of the store. Be like, eh, Wednesdays, female navvies get to buy stuff for cheaper. Uh, green mystery data. We get a book fragment. I mean, I do need more of those. And we get top man, top man again. I already had top man. 
Starman can also get them, but less regularly. Every day, Starman and Roll give fortunes. Oh, okay. I'm trying to think of other, like, female navvies. I can only think of Roll and Ring. I have to be missing one. I know there has to be one more. Like in anything Battle Network. Oh, hey, look. The green mystery data. Uh, what can I do? We can go Aqua Soul just to have better movement. If I could get rid of the electric guy. So I could try this fight again. I could lock enemy this. But honestly, this one feels more RNG whether or not I... Yeah, you know what, whatever. Medi! I knew I was missing one. I knew I was missing the character. Is that really all the female navvies and all of Battle Network? Now, granted, I know, like, almost all of them are based on classic Mega Man characters, and Splash Woman wasn't a thing till after Battle Network. But there's one more right there. And it's funny, because to add more female characters in Battle Network, they had to gender bent one of them and then create a brand new one. <laughs> I think that should probably tell you everything you need to know about Mega Man's, like, continuity when it comes to female characters. Like, actually, they might have a better, uh, loadout in, like, Star Force when they're not basing characters on the classic games. Oh, dang it. Come on. Damn it. I was trying. Gives you a lucky number. I haven't tried on Star Man, but yeah. She gives out lucky numbers 1 through, through 4, 5 through 8. I'm guessing 9 through 12. And what do these lucky numbers do? That's one way to increase roll, rolls max HP. Find your hero heart data. So, okay. So from what I understand, roll gets gives out a fortune. One through four, five through eight, and maybe nine through 12. If she says your lucky number is three, that, needs, that means you need to go to internet area three to find an HP, a max HP thing for her. Or there's just something in that specific area. Or if it's three, then it means anything within internet one through four. She'll say one through four, but it'll be in one of those areas. Okay. Okay, I think I get it.
Come on. It's not going well for me. Come on. There's also random. Uh, also, I'm scattered about. Then you could get randomly in Mr. Day. Like, what type of items? Like, normally in Green Mr. Day, it's like chips and zenny. What do you mean by items? Use them while you're navigating as your pet. Oh, a minigame? Okay. You could just get a random minigame while you're running around this roll? Okay. Now, I did watch, like, a video talking about, like, the spin-off file network stuff. And talk about 4.5. If I'm correct, 4.5 has, like, an in-game clock and you have to play by at certain times to get everything. Is that right? Okay, what do I do? What's the best way to handle this? I think we should start with Guardian. And then end this and try to... Try to just survive. I'll just set the guardian there. Oh, I got both of them. We are just gonna end this. And use both of these. Got them both. Bug chain. Okay. When you play a game kind of like Pound the Pawn, you get to solve math problems and time limit. Hmm. If you win it, you get more max HP. Oh, okay. I, I, I think I'm getting it. Do I want to lock enemy that? No. Honestly, if I'm going to lock enemy, I want to lock enemy the the shadow heal, uh, shadow, the shadow normal navvies. Which I can't seem to... I can't seem to find anymore. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. You do have to wait for the right times. And, like, there's a part of me that wants to try out uh, that game. Maybe stream it. But that seems also very... You, you have to play it at very specific times. You know, and that might be hard for me to do. Unless I just play it on my own time, you know? There we go. It's more like days of the week than times. That's... That's more what I meant, sorry. Oh, five buck fragments. We'll take that. So far, I think we found the best uh, spot for bug fragments in terms of the amount you get per Green Mystery Data. Only time re related thing is the everyday tournaments. Oh, okay. How does those work? Again, part of me has thought about streaming 4.5 because I never played it before, but I feel like that might be really hard to do. Just a tournament you can do that aren't major plot tournaments, I see. Oh, here we go. This is what I was looking for. So now what I could do... Go to Protosoul. This is my only way to use a sword. Oh, dang. Get random chips doing it. Could get good stuff. Is it like, are there stuff that you can only get there? Okay, lock enemy. I'd rather have that particular fight. 
Silver tickets and gold tickets. Okay, what do those do? Those sound important. This is the fight I was looking for originally. Come on, that was just rude. No. I thought, for some reason I thought, I'm thinking, oh, they will only shoot me when they're in my, when they're in range of me. No, they'll just shoot randomly. This isn't necessarily easier, is it? There's a door that blocks access from internet area 4 to 5. With a silver ticket, you could get through once until you jack it. Ooh. And I'm guessing area internet area 5 through 8, you said, has better stuff, and you want to eventually get through there. Or you can have an S license. How do you get an S license? Is it like Battle Network 2 with the license system? Just have to do, like, a virus gauntlet? Beanie a silver tournament. Hmm. So the sil you beat a silver tournament, and you your character basically permanently gets a silver ticket. And from what I heard, you have to do this per Navi. Like, what, if you get it once with Mega Man, yeah, you have it for Mega Man, but you don't have it for Roll. Which you sign up for during the weekdays, and you do it on the weekend. Ugh. See, that's the problem right there. I don't stream on the weekends. I would have to change, like, the in-game clock. Or the computer's clock. And that, I don't, I don't even know why I want to mess with that while I'm streaming. I don't know. Tried that once. Said I was streaming for 12 hours. It was kind of weird. Didn't know what that would do. It was kind of weird. I just wanted to be like, you know what? No, I'm not. I, I don't know if I really want to mess with this. Sign up one, uh, one every day for a different navi. I guess you. I guess that's how you would have to do it. All right. Let's hope he doesn't destroy the green mystery data. And there's a gold tournament. I'm guessing the gold tournament also does basically the same thing as the silver, but lets you access areas 9 through 12. particular fight. Wait. Hold on. Ah, oh, come on, dude. The official tournament gives you a trophy. Is the trophy just for aesthetics? And the trophy's a trophy. It gives you nothing. Once you beat the if determine your Kasira to have won with that Navi. Ah. Uh. All the viruses will get harder too once you do that with that Navi. That's kind of weird. <coughs> you go to area one, and they're all just normal Mets, right? And, you know, you play as Mega Man, and then all of a sudden, like, you you get the trophy, you go back to Area 1, and now they're, like, the Super Met Tars, and like, oh, wow, this is difficult. I, I guess I made it harder for everyone. Then you swap to Roll, and they're all just the level 1s. It's like, what? You know what? I 
think I might need to try something like that. Because I need to kill him quickly. And the undernez in the later later areas, right? Like 9 through 12. With the trophy, you can open the door leading to the chaos area. What's in the chaos area? It sounds like... You're spending a lot of time trying to power up whatever Navi you're currently playing. So you could beat a tournament on specific days. And then while you're waiting for that tournament to happen, you're just spending more time powering up. And that is just rude. Hey, Garugamesh, how's it going? There's a man in really hard viruses in mini games, I see. Right now, I'm just trying to open up green mystery data in Black Earth 1, and it's not going well. It is definitely not going well. I think I should just cut my losses and go fight Duo. I want, f I want fast, cut fast gauge though. Under tournaments. Uh, so there's like four different main tournaments you have to do in 4.5. Nope, still haven't found the fight. I really want fast gauge. I really do. Fast gauge star would be so useful right now. Especially when we're doing the Navi fights. That's weirdly specific to enter the under tournament. So the under tournament is the final tournament you can do. Uh, what do you get out of that? Do you know? Well, clearly, if you beat the official tournament. You clearly didn't win with that Navi if you have the under tournament to access after a certain point. Wait, is that how you're supposed to unlock base? Is that what it is? You beat the under tournament with someone and then you unlock base. Still, still no green. Base is behind a door in the chaos area, so, okay. Only appears after you complete the library. And to complete the library, you have to spend a lot of time uh, playing as multiple different navvies because they can only open certain pathways which so lets you get access to certain ships. I think I see where this is going. Show tournaments on every day. You're given rankings on all the battles and can get ships. Hmm. Okay, I know I set my lock enemy to this enemy formation, but I thought it would just be this enemy type. Okay, now I think I have a different question with how this game works. I think this might have been a change from 1 through 3. I feel like in 1 through 3, when you use a lock enemy, it's just making you encounter a certain virus. 
It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter the formation. It's just more of, hey, you want to fight this virus? Use a lock enemy. You have a better chance of finding a a formation with that virus. And if there's a specific combination, you might be more likely to find that formation. Now it feels like when you use lock enemy, you want the same enemy formation. And now I'm not even getting. It's a particular formation. Okay, so I messed up with that lock enemy. I needed to wait and find the one particular formation. That's why I keep finding this one. When I'm pretty sure in 1 through 3, I could get that formation, get a lock enemy, and then I have a higher chance of finding any formation with that particular enemy. Or was it always just particular enemy formations? Here we go. And, well, I can at least kill one. Now let's hope he doesn't destroy the mystery data. I can't do anything. Too bad the boomerang doesn't count as a sword. It's a blunt object, not a... Uh, not a sharp one. And too bad the power of the sun doesn't work either. I guess you could change everything to a poison tile, if you have to get in three. Okay. Bug chain, that's not what I want. I'm honestly thinking I need to come back later. I want to try again, but... Well, this, this formation works too. I'm gonna go right here. No! Come on! That is just mean! Did you see that? All the electric guy needed to do was just move up. But no! He had to stay in the bottom row, and then freaking the jumping guy just blocked his path, so it was trapped there. It was a times two as, as well. That's what's sad. One of his charge shots is pull One of his charge shots. Meaning you can have more than one different type of charge shot. Okay. Because there's no chip codes, you can constantly add obstacles and throw them at them. I see. That's the thing with- that's part of the reason why I haven't messed around with Junk Soul in this. Because I don't really have- a, you kind of need a folder that's specifically made for it. And I don't have that. Oh no, he's trapped! See what I mean? Let's buster up power-ups. Each Navi has Y mystery data specifically relating to them. Usually a permanent buster. Hmm. All I ever get... Uh, yeah, I actually had some teeth removed before, yeah. Back in high school. It was a thing. Still, Junkman still needs. Uh, Junkman still feels the need to stand in front of his target despite the auto aiming. Yeah. Did it hurt? No, not really. I think uh, when I got the teeth removed, it was before anything could have happened. You know what I mean? 
Wait, they caught it early? And there's that. So, like... Yeah... No, not really. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't think I was, anyway. I don't know, I don't feel things anymore. Uh... It's just like, yeah, I went under, and then I I, I basically uh, slept for a little bit, woke up like what feels like two seconds later, and then the teeth were gone. Again, uh, the procedure. Uh, they let me fall, they had me fall asleep, and then two, what feels like two seconds later, I woke up, and the teeth were removed. <laughs> That's what it was. <laughs> And then, I, you know, I had, like, cotton in my mouth to, like, you know, you know, to help with all that swelling. And then I was on, I was on painkillers. It was, uh, like, I was so numb I could barely move. Like, I remember, like, so after, so this was back in high, when I was in high school, and uh, <coughs> so like, you know, a, 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 after we got that done, you know, we, we were in the car and we had to stop at, like, you know, a uh, pharmacy to get like the painkillers, right? And uh, we had to go all the way to like a Safeway. I was still in the car because I I wasn't moving, so my mom goes into Safeway, and you know she gets that all set up. Be like, hey, uh, I need the painkillers. And then I'm sitting in the car. I don't know what's happening. It's like an hour later. And apparently, when they said they'll get it done later, they didn't mean they get it done like right away and come back in 20 minutes. No, no, no. They'll mean they'll start in like 20 minutes getting all everything prepped. Because apparently they thought we were going to leave and come back later. No. And my mom's like... My mom's like, my son's in the car and needs the painkillers right now. What are you doing? You're not doing anything. So, yeah, that was fun. So, I was in the car just trying to listen to music and just be like, what the hell is taking so long? Dude, like, I, I wasn't delirious when they gave me the heavy stuff. Like, nothing like that. But, like, I wasn't moving. Like... While I was on these painkillers, uh, a couple of my friends, like, came over and chatted for a few minutes. Uh, and, like, I was... I, I was wanting to talk with them, but, like, I, I, want, I got off the couch and I was, like, just talking in the kitchen. Dude, I could barely hold myself up. I was, like, constantly, like, using my hand to, like, prep, uh, hold myself up on, like, the counter. And I was just, like, I was just like this the entire time, just holding myself up. That's how strong those painkillers were. I was kind of numb. <laughs> and then they, they left shortly after. I'm like, okay, I'm going to lay back down. Okay, you know what? This isn't working. I'm going to... Let's get another lock enemy. I have the money. Yeah, I have the money. Now that I know it's specific enemy formations. Now that I know that, we'll try that again. Because this is not working. Definitely memorable, indeed. Yeah, I didn't really... I don't remember any pain. It's just a thing that happened, honestly. Again, I think they just caught it really early. But yeah. Honestly, the annoying part was just having to sit in the car for like an hour minimum. Just waiting for the painkillers, because, you know, being stuck in the car for a certain amount of time is just kind of, you want to at least get out of there, you know? Agonizing? More like I was bored. Because I was expecting, like, 20 minutes, you know? Dude, like, uh, 
where I live, it's like never hot. It's like always rain, so heat wasn't a problem. Basically, imagine Seattle. That's basically where I am. <laughs> so it, it it's always rain. In fact, it, it, it it's I think it's raining now. If not, it was earlier. So that's just life where I'm at. So, although like lately, summer gets pretty hot for relatively my area. But no, at the time it was cloudy or rain, whatever it was. Why'd you ask about the teeth removal anyway? <laughs> what, are you about to get teeth removed, or is it just a conversation starter? I'm fine with either, honestly. Yeah. But yeah, that was definitely a experience I had. Possibly both, I see. Oh yeah, yeah. I don't think I was really scared or anything. It's just like, oh, okay, I have to do this. Okay, dude. Like, sometimes I I just don't know what to talk about. So I'm I'm okay with anything, honestly. I just never know what to talk about. So my conversations just end up being like, oh, I need to grab this. I need to grab this. Oh, we're doing this now. It was a dentist who did it? Um, I think so. I, I forget if I went to a specific, like, dentist office, just a general dentist office, or if it was a specific office that was, like, very specifically takes teeth out, you know? I, I, it was probably just a dentist office. I know I didn't go to a hospital, so. Yeah, it was probably just a dentist office. Better health insurance? I have, I don't know. I wouldn't even guess on how that whole thing went down. I mean, yeah, Canada has free health care, but from what I understand, you have to spend like five years getting your appointment, so... Yeah, from what I understand, that's how it works. Oh, now that, that I don't need get in three, I get it right when I need, when I don't need it. I see how it is, game. Like, I don't fully understand, like, that whole system, but I know it's not, like... I know Canada's system is not as, like, great as everyone makes it sound, you know? I hear, like, Germany's is, like, better, but I don't know the details. I just have a friend that mentions, like, oh, Germany has, like, better healthcare. I'm like, but I don't know the details of it. I'm like, okay, I'll believe you. Sure. No, healthcare in America is, like, you know, you have you have the sniffles. And then they, you go in, they're just like, hey, here, take this, take this cold medicine. That's a thousand dollars. Honestly, the problem in America is, like, the pricing of everything. And that was before all the inflation and all that. Like, it was always bad. The, like, with how pricing everything with the hospitals are, it's ridiculous. I think I'll do this. That's why I really hope I don't need to go to the hospital for anything. Because I know if I need to go to the hospital for anything, that's just like... Um, <laughs> you have to take out a loan to pay it off. $800 amulets bill, exactly. Oh, really? 
He's starting red sun. Oh, perfect. And make sure uh, they get the one in Luck Town. That's early on, too. Because that's always a weird line that you don't expect. Boomerang. Yeah, I just hope I never have to go to the hospital for anything. I'll just be like, I'll get shot in the leg or something, right? And I'll just be like, no, I'll take it out myself. <laughs> or just leave it there. Because the hospital will make me pay $5,000 just to take it out. Whereas I could take it out myself for free. No. No, after a certain point, you just gotta be like, uh, do I live with a b bullet wound in my foot? Or do I pay $10,000 to have the doctors take it out? I'm joking, by the way, but, uh, the exaggerated joking, you know what I mean? So I think... I do local injections instead of doing, doing going on under unless it was hospital. Um, yeah, I think I didn't. I don't remember having like laughing gas or anything. If that like sleeping gas, if that's what you mean. I think they did an injection. That sounds right. I don't like. I don't exactly remember. Maybe, I don't... Dude, like, I don't remember. Again, like... They put me under and then I woke up and they were done, basically. So... That's what the sounds horrifying. Again, if they just have you fall asleep, you won't notice. It sounds horrifying and then you realize, oh, I'm asleep. You won't know. <laughs> Yeah, no, I was asleep. So, I, I don't know what went down. Again, I just kind of wo woke up what felt like two seconds later. Do I have... No, I know I don't have the money. Yeah, pretty much. I run, I don't want to fight a spider. There we go. Yeah, you gotta forgive me. Like, it's been, like, ten plus years, you know? I don't exactly remember all the tiny details. One thing I do remember, though, when I was waking up, they were still kind of working on me, like, just doing the last little bit. And when I was, I was still kind of dazed from waking up. And I'm hearing, like, the sounds of, like, you know, the drills and all that. And I'm I don't know why, but my mind's like, oh, that sounds like a cool Pokemon battle theme. <laughs> like all the, like the sound, like the drill sounds or whatever. But it was near the end when they were wrapping up. And it's just like, oh. It sounds like good battle music. That was kind of my mindset. I don't know why. I mean, when when you're waking up from you know from a dream or actually no, there was no dream. I just it was just dark darkness. Dude, I don't even want to know. I don't even know what happened. It's 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 just a thing that exists. It probably, uh, 
whatever tools they use, it's probably like has ex it's probably like a long tube. Like here, I have a uh, I have like pliers here. Think of like this, but then like curves, and that's probably how it works. That's my guess. But maybe even thinner than that. I don't know. That was my guess. I don't know. I'm not a doctor. I don't know anything. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna run. I don't want to deal with spiders. Fine, I guess I'm fighting a spider. I guess I should just use the green mystery data. It's very informative. I, I, it, even if it's like completely wrong, and I have no idea what I'm talking about, the guess is all that matters, right? Okay, almost back to under that six. Take the opportunity to heal up. Number soul yet. Okay. Get rid of that. I guess the real question is if you're gonna get like this type of procedure, are you gonna be put under or are you gonna be awake? I don't even want to attempt trying something like that awake. Like, if I was awake during that, I probably would freak out a bit. <laughs> Let's not use the boomerang, we'll go with this. Oh. Well, that's different. <laughs> they only use in, they only use that in hospitals? I know I wasn't... Well, maybe, I don't know. Well, if I was in a hospital, it wasn't, like, anything too big. It was just, like, a one floor type of building sort of thing. So I think I don't think it was a hospital. It might have, it probably was some sort of dentist office for all I know. Oh no, I can't run. I guess I'll just stand here and avoid the poison. Let's see if I can run again. Just block. Oh yeah, 14 hour flights, that's gonna suck. That's gonna be, that's gonna be really annoying. It's basically like the same thing as like a 14 hour car ride, you know? It's just like, you're so cramped, you're stuck in the chair the entire time. Just want to get up and move around, but you're in a cramped box. Yeah, that's gonna suck. And even if you bring stuff to do, like on the plane, like a, like you, like a switch or something, that's still only gonna solve like half your problems on a plane. After a certain point, you just gotta hope you can fall asleep. And that kills like a good eight hours.
planes nowadays have, like, charging ports, right? Games, movies, me Yeah, exactly. You're gonna need a lot of that stuff to pass the time. But yeah, don't... Don't airplanes have, like, charging ports, like, in front of your seats now? They do? Okay. Because I remember, you know, flying when I was younger. I had my Game Boy Advance, and I gotta hope that the battery it lasts long enough for the for the plane. <laughs> Way to play the new Peach game for the plane. Oh, you know, it's nice to have a brand new game to kill time with on a long flight. Because you know you're going to be spending as much time on that particular game while you're on there. Bunch of PS2 ROMs and Steam Deck. Yeah. All that works. All in play. Hey, that you have options. Okay, now we're gonna look for the specific enemy formation. Cold Man Dark Soul, okay. got Twitch. You know, they say like, hey, don't use the internet while you're on a plane because reasons, so I I don't know how all that works. It's like, why can't I access my phone and go on the internet while I'm on a plane? Oh, Guru Gamesh, I just thought of something. I think you did, like, a... A few times, you were doing a, uh... Exclamation clip... Thing. If that's supposed to, like, create a clip, I never had that set up, because I didn't think about it. So, if that's what it does... Yeah, I should have, uh, made one. I never thought about that. A clip command? Is that what it's supposed to do? Because I never made one. And you think something like that would just be a default thing. But it sounds like I'm gonna have to make one. Okay, I'm gonna have to make one. Yeah, because uh, those, those clips were just never made. I just checked. Yeah, my bad. Because oh, I don't know what I'm doing. A lot of the things where it's like, oh, I need a clip command. Now that I know, now that I know I need a clip command, I need to make one. And if I'm correct, you can't make a clip when it's a VOD, isn't it? Can you make clips with VODs? I know you can make highlights, or I can make highlights, but can you make clips? I think you can, huh? That's the thing, I don't really make too many clips, or highlights for that matter, because I don't really know what's good clip worthy, what's a clip worthy thing or highlight worthy thing you know i usually just let leave that to chat most of the time you know i'm kind of mindset of be like hey if chat thinks this is clip worthy then then it must be clip worthy <laughs> you know
Oh, good. We at least got rid of him. Well, we got the green. The question is, is this the chip I want? Hmm. I think we'll go with this. Okay, I did that too soon. Oh, by the way, chat. There it is! We got it! No lock enemy needed. Make it a save. Woo! Only spent like an hour and a half doing that. Okay, uh... While I get this set back up, uh, last Friday, I went to see the new Ghostbusters. It is just okay. And on, it's like the okay in the sense like it's on the verge of like not good. You know what I mean? Like, there were pro <sighs> there are probably worse Ghostbusters movies, but there are definitely better ones. Yeah, we got fast gauge, and I'm definitely throwing that on the shortcuts. There we go. All right. So let's see. I got fast gauge. I can't go any further. Uh, I, w I got all of the Navi customizer parts that I can right now. Uh, I'm trying to think. I know I got all the blue mystery data. If I didn't, we'll grab them next time. Okay, let's go fight Duo. Oh, sh I forgot I still had humor. Let's go fight. Let's go fight Duo. Where's my attack? There we go. Alright. Let's go fight Duo and start the next playthrough. Because I think I've done everything that I can right now. Can't think of anything else. Also, chat, I know I asked this last time, but I don't think I got an answer. In the Legacy Collection specifically, if I thought I heard that this is how it works now. If you beat Duo, but decide to not do a new playthrough and just continue where you leave off, does this music go back to normal? Because this music will never go away in the base Battle Network 4. GBA. Did they fix that? I thought I heard that they did that, but I don't remember. Well, actually, I just don't know if that's true or not. Now I'm, like, double-checking. Like, like, I don't know. Um, all these are basically navvies. Yeah, I think we could just move on. which way I go. Again, when it comes to HP memories, one's in the antenna, one's in Black Earth 2. And now I gotta play this carefully. Actually, we'll just run. Yeah, one's in Black Earth 2, one's in the antenna, and I think the other three I have to buy. One's in Undernet 1, and I think the other two are in... Undernet 5. I think that's right. Can't really do anything else. Alright. Let's go fight Duo. 
Yeah, I can't save if I move forward. I don't know how Mega Man knows this. But we also can't escape. Come on. Let's -a go. Fast gauge. Uh, Invis, come on. Come on, game. Okay. <laughs> I love it when the AI Dark Dark Soul uses Guardian. I love it so much. Because he always like hurts himself. And that's just 200 damage for free. All right. How I want to handle this. Realizing this again, I don't have a good folder. I should definitely spend time getting rid of chips. If I'm gonna use this, I wanna wait. We could start with Number Soul. No, let's spend time getting rid of this chip. We'll Mega Buster it. Almost have power driver, and I don't even know if it's gonna work. All right, we'll number soul it. I was hoping for invis, but okay. Can't really make a buster this now. Oh, I forgot how fast that is, and I can't use pit hockey either. Nope, can't use it now. Um, I'm not going to fuse yet. Oh, do I... Where's getting rid of chips? Getting rid of chips is better. There we go. Ah, I wasted those shots. Okay. I can use this. And I can get rid of this. Safely. That works. That worked well. Now we could go Wood Soul. Get a heal in. This is bad already. Okay, I need the heal. Oh, I looked out here. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Metal Soul is not going to help me. And 
I'm on my last health hit point. All right. Aquasol's not going to help me either. I don't have any water chips. Let's get rid of these. There it is. Okay. Let's try that again. I might have to swap my folder around. I have a lot of chips that go across the ground. And it won't work. Can I run? Can I please run? Dang it. I think it's better to be up here. Now this just sucks. I hate these guys. Is it time to dark chip? No, it is not. Who needs dark chips when you have reflect? You have reflect. There you go. I hate these guys so much. I still think the spiders are worse. But I don't like those guys. I don't like biting them. Okay, I guess we'll start with Quick's Power and Gun Soul. Well, I dealt a lot of damage. And, come on, Pile Driver. There we go. I win. Multi-hit moves for the win. What'd you miss? Uh, me losing to duo. Now, um, the second attempt. I mentioned I was going somewhere. Oh, I think I was just planning on, like, fighting duo. I think that's all I was saying. Let's get rid of this chip. If I'm gonna use this, I either want a times two or be number soul. I didn't, I didn't crash, did I? No, I wouldn't have. I didn't crash. Okay, well, I can heal up again. At this point, I just kind of want to get rid of some of my chips. Get rid of this. This is not helpful to me. Okay, I could go Wood Soul. Was there Thursday? Oh, I mentioned that I went to, uh, I went to the new Ghostbusters on Friday. This must have really inspired the Star Force games. It it feels like it. Again, so much so that I I'm shocked that Duo technically hasn't popped up. Yeah, the the new Ghostbusters came uh, came out like this last th uh, Thursday, Friday, and again, it's just okay. Uh, 
let's change my folder out. Okay, I need stuff that can hit him. Uh, that's not, like, on the ground. Let's see. Flame line doesn't work, blizzard doesn't work. Twin fang. Ooh. Hmm, maybe. You know, let's throw those in. Uh, let's get rid of magnet bolts. Try to go for another program advance with that. Let's see. No, none of those. I could hit him with long blades. Yeah, I could hit him with long blades. That's not bad. They want people to forget about four. Yeah, uh, that that movie had no references at all, and I'm okay with that. As someone who has not seen 2016, I'm glad they didn't reference 2016. But eh, the movie's just okay. And when I say it's okay, it's on the verge of, like, bad. Not, not, like, it's more towards the bad than the good part of okay. Oh, Aaron. I can maybe throw in Z Saber. Let's take a look. Hold on. On blades. Looks like that, that, that'll work fine. Yeah, um, one of the biggest problems with that movie, it, it, there's too many characters. And because there's too many characters, they have like three different scripts for the movie that just... And they have to try to take these three different scripts and try to stitch them together and it doesn't work. Like they'll focus too much on one thing or the other, and sometimes they actually feel like they forgot certain plot details. Mm -hmm. So C tier probably. Ghostbusters 1 is better, obviously. Afterlife was better. Other than that, um, maybe it's Frozen Empire. Maybe it's Ghostbusters 2. But I have not seen Ghostbusters 2, so I couldn't say for sure. But 2016 is still dead lap. Oh. Still dead last. Kind of like subplots? Um, I don't even know if subplots is, is the right way to call it. I mean, I guess some of it is a subplot. It's like, okay. You have plot A where... What's her name? Phoebe is benched because she's working as a Ghostbuster, but she's 15. So, the mayor, who's the same guy who tried to shut down the Ghostbusters back in the original. You know, it's just like finding finding plenty of ways to shut them down. So she's benched and now she's just like, I want to be a Ghostbuster. But they're just like, dude, it, it, if you do that, we'll, there will be no more Ghostbusters in, together. Just deal with it for like three more years, but she won't get, get over it. Got your string to hang the airport. Yeah, uh, nice hand. Yeah, have a good stream, uh, Monzai. And have a good flight. Have a good trip to the Japan. Have a good... Just have a good. So yeah, Ghostbuster. Uh, you have that family drama side plot. You have, like, the main, like, ice demon guy. That's the main bad guy side plot. Or main plot. Uh, I guess I could get rid of these. Or do I get rid of this? 
they all get rid of these. Uh, and I feel like there was, like, one more side plot. Oh, yeah, the ghost core, like, all that. It feels like they were trying to... They, they just had too many things going on. And it's like, cut some characters out. Cut some side... Uh, uh, make the story flow a bit better. And it could work. Okay, I can go number soul if I want to. Actually, yeah, we will go number soul. And I'll grab this. Because I can use number soul for this. Actually, I can use it for twin thing as well. If I get the last one. Oh, I left out there. Okay. I can use Prick's power. I could save the sword for later. If I'm going to be hitting him, it's basically with Reflect. I don't think I'm getting the program. Advance. Let's hit him with Long Blade. Ah, dang it! He trapped me there! Okay, what do I do? Now uh, let's let's use Gun Soul. Let's use it up. That's kind of what I was waiting my, for an invis for. Oh, perfect timing. That was perfect. Now I could do this, and I'll heal. And luckily, he didn't crack that many panels. Come guardian. Ah, uh, that sucks. That didn't work. Guardian, like, is blocked by the laser move. Let's go for another... Let's heal up. Because I have a feeling I'm gonna need it. Oh no, this is bad. This is where Float Chew would be nice. <laughs> okay, in this F G H, and I have pile driver too. Look at that, and Duo will die to himself. How fitting. There it is. Just had to change my folder around. See? So simple. It's like 5 p.m. Gotta go. Yeah, you have a good day, Guru Gamesh. Uh, I actually have to make this a shorter stream anyway, because I got some stuff to do. I might do the Shade Man stuff, because... Yeah, you know what? I'm I'm gonna do the Shade Man stuff and get things ready for the 
the first den tournament, but I got stuff to do, so. Yeah, I know. Uh, geez, finding fast gauge took forever. That's part of the problem. I thought I was going to be able to get more done. And I have to sit through the credits again. Because what else are you supposed to do? But yeah, um, this will be the final playthrough. I wouldn't have needed to do this if I didn't do the whole Red Sun Navis too soon. Because I have to find Cold Man. Anyway. Uh, yeah, we're gonna beat we're gonna finish the Shade Man scenario. Just get that done. And luckily it goes by pretty quickly. And then tomorrow we'll Duo versus duo, what a finish. I think that's how I beat him the first time, too. Actually, no, it would have been the second time, because I didn't grab duo on my first playthrough. It is a very fitting way to beat the final boss. You know? It is. But this ne once we're done with the fourth playthrough, or basically get to the final boss, or you know, get to uh, Meteor Comp, that's when we're finally able to really focus on the post-game stuff. A.K.A. all the Navi stuff I was supposed to do. Yeah. Yeah, I have to take care of all that Navi stuff, and that's where the main bulk of everything's gonna take. I do want to look up and see if the music does ch uh, go back to normal if you beat Duo. And then just continue to save. Because I might go and fight Duo on the fourth playthrough just to change the music back to normal. Because the desperation music is... Uh, who likes the desperation music in this game? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I wanted to get more done. The fast gauge took forever. Hopefully, uh, in the tournaments, we should be fighting Gutsman, Windman, and Coldman. All the Navi custom... The one last Navi customizer is one in the antenna. Everything else is you have to buy. Yeah. I don't need to collect, because I got every ship. At least not for now. Yeah. I just wish I could skip through this it reminds me of oh what was it star force 2 where you can't skip the credits uh because in star force 2 if you complete everything there is a super secret final fight with rogue where he's like super tough but you have to beat the game and then it's a rematch after you beat the game. And he's so hard. But it's so frustrating to... Where if you want to refight him... You have to beat the final boss. Then you have to sit through the credits. Then you get one shot. Anyway. Later, Garugamesh. Have a good day. Like I said, gonna, fin gonna do the sa Shade Man stuff. And then wrap it up. Game four. Again, on my GBA save file, I could go to game 10. That's where I, <laughs> I played this game too much. Emails, yeah, virus scan. Yeah, with Star Force, I have the first game for Dragon, I have Ninja, and I have Red Joker. Anyway. You all have a good day. This probably won't take that long. I'll see if I can make that clip uh, command thing. Because, honestly, I probably should have made that a long time ago. Oh yeah, I should put my folder back to normal.
Yeah, Vulcan. And Boomerang will do the trick. Okay, uh, I want to put my folder back to normal. I had it before. Uh, I need my air hockeys. I need my magnet bolts, I guess. Because they're helpful, I guess. And air hockey, where are ya? That's all I replaced. Yeah, okay. Gotta get the- okay, gotta get the line. Gotta get some money from daddy. And luckily I have maxed out unlockers so we can get a lot of stuff. Uh, and by a lot of stuff, I mean bug fragments. Is any. Yeah. <sighs> Final playthrough. Already like 40 hours. Ugh. I'll worry about Blue Mystery Daily later. It's, it's all just bug fragments. Start running from fights because I don't care. Keep on moving. I guess I'll grab this one. It's not a big deal. I'm right here. Oh, Zenny. Grab that. More Zenny. Buy this. For 500, even though I just opened a green mystery data for 600. You know. Because 500 zenny is very spendy. Now we talk to everyone. Everyone. There we go. Talk to Dex. Yeah, we're gonna meet on the net later. Do you know how a virus buster? Yep. Pets are so cool. Indeed they are, sir. There we go. Alright. Now we go to this guy. And buy on traps, because I forgot to do that. What else am I supposed to use my money for? Shopping. Ignore the two girls. Daddy might come back. But, eh, uh, he's shopping. There we go. Okay, what's the blue mystery data here? Is it bug fragments? No, it's Zenny. What about this one? Bug fragment. Okay. Talk to you two. Can't do anything here. On the net later. Cutscene, we can skip. I think we go this way? Yeah. Oh, there's gonna be a tournament popping up. Oh boy, I can't wait to do that. Something's going on in the stereo. Whatever is going on. Oh no, a vampire. We have to go on the net 
and save Roll before she gets kidnapped, and then she gets kidnapped. We're getting ready to start finding the random, like, the navvies. I thought about just running into Aquaman right now, but I'm like, nah, let's just save that. Let's just save all of that for basically post-game. Oh no! Shade Man found Roll. Roll is kidnapped. Oh, I should have stayed in. That's a green mystery data. That could be bug fragments. I should have stayed in. I need as many bug fragments as possible. Let's open this up. Create a shortcut? Permanently this time. You know, I'm not I'm not doing a fifth playthrough, so that's permanently there. Okay. I guess we'll grab this. 900 Zenny. On, moving. Another green. Oh, right. I could be opening some purples. Worry about it later. Again, it all should just be bug fragments now. Pretty much. I also want to use my money to buy the board parts when they become available. There, grab that. More Zenny, very nice. And, oh no! I can't fly! However, will I get to you? Megman really needs to learn how to fly. I have float shoes. That should work. Okay, so we need to go into the main square. That's not gonna work. We talk to you. Then we take the upper path. Oh no, sound waves. I can't go further. My ears hurt. Time to get a earphone. A single earphone. Not earphones, just earphone. And with my 900 HP, I should be able to handle this. How's the game going? It's going all right, uh, Tyler. We're on the fourth playthrough now. So that's fun. I It took me like an hour and a half to get a fast gauge star. Took like, duo took like three attempts. And we're on the fourth playthrough. Well, we'll finally be able to get everything done on this playthrough. How's it going, Tyler?
now that I got my single single earphone to work with, I can now go to the speaker. Uh, going back to three to do post games since I hear so much good stuff. Ooh, yeah, post games good in in three. Uh, <coughs> have you done any of the post game in three, or uh, have you done some of it already? Yeah, uh, three has a really good post game. Oh, by the way. One of the Giga Chips that you're gonna need, you have to win through multiplayer. Through PvP. Kinda like in Battle Network 2. How to get like those 10 special chips. You had to win them just randomly in multiplayer. You did a new playthrough. I'm assuming you're doing a new playthrough on the other version. To readjust yourself. Ah, uh, it was right there, too. Start the sonar. Isn't it fun having to play this game four times? It's a good it's a good thing the gameplay is good and fun to play, but that only goes so far. A fun game can only go so far when you have to play the game this many times. Played white person actually gonna end up getting punk this time. Yeah, you actually get to fight punk. Uh, what else? You also get, uh, bowl man, if you play blue. Granted, in post-game, you will fight bowl and mist man. You just won't get their versions one through four chips. It's a post-game thing. So even if you never, like, even started up a playthrough of Blue, you'll get to fight Bull Man and try him out. But Punk altogether is just... Uh, that's There's no, like, other fight you can do in White. It's just Punk or nothing, you know? Put these games up, I guess. Uh, you'll understand once you actually do post game. Basically, once you go to the secret area. By the way, I uh, I don't know how much you're really gonna focus on getting like every Navi customizer stuff, but I would probably plan out your route for Navi customizer. Like, for me, I really started, like, I made sure to get shield first. So I can get, uh, reflect. Because that's too good. Because getting reflect is really good for getting bug fragments. Oh. One more bat. That was a good run. And then, like, after that, I kind of planned out, like, what I needed and what I was going for. Because you're going to need to be in custom style to get certain chips and chip codes. So you kind of want to save that for when you're about to do all your chip farming. You're going to... Yeah, that was custom style. You need team style to get level 4 uh, Navi chips. So when you're ready to do the Navi hunting, you need to be able to be in, ch in uh, team style. 
So I would consider planning out your uh, your uh, style changes and kind of what order you're to go into. Molly, what are you doing? I think what I did was I went shield first. Then I think I went into shadow style because that's the blue exclusive. And then I think I went team custom and then guts. I think that sounds right. That shield style is your first style change though. You were going for shadow, st shadow style. It really helps when uh, you just make guard your shortcut and that's basically the only chip you use. And if you're going for shadow style, just put invis as your shortcut and just only use invis and like one other chip. You gotta be careful though. Because when you're trying to go for one of these styles, uh, if to get custom style, you need to, when you go into a single, go into a fight, you need to take three or more chips into a fight and that'll give you points to custom. So like if I did this, this does nothing as far as I'm aware. But if I did this, this is points towards custom style. So when you're playing out your stuff, you really got to be careful. Also, one thing that will help. So now that you're in shield style and you're trying to get into. And let's say you're trying to get into shadow style first uh, and after that. What you could do is you can have, you could still, you have Invis as your shortcut. So that way you use it up and that way you get points for Shadow Style. But if you have Reflect Navi Customizer, have that kill everything. Kill everything with that. So that way it would get you points to uh, Shield Style. But since you're already in Shield Style, it doesn't go towards it. Or if it does go into it, it won't make a difference. So it would go to the next best thing, Shadow Style. All right. But would she? Ooh. Interesting. Anyway, as much as I would like to continue, I actually have a few things to do today. So I have to wrap it up here. It's always at these tournaments, you know? I always set it up right before a tur one of these tournaments. But yeah, I'm gonna wrap it up. Thanks for everyone who showed up. I'm doing these streams Monday through Friday at noon Pacific time. If you wanna see the old streams that are not on Twitch anymore, they're on YouTube at scottbot 64 Stream Archives. Yeah, uh, I got some stuff to do. Tomorrow, we're gonna work on playthrough four. If it's anything like the last couple, we should be able to get done with the story stuff in two more streams, and then we'll really focus on all the Navi stuff and all of that. Anyway, have a good day. Later.